What is up, up dudes? Okay. Got uh, I got my boy Brandy Boudreau here. I'm gonna go over some uh, partner channel updates. We had a great week last week. Uh, let's jump into this. All right, so now I've got the numbers pulled up from uh, October. I want to throw out props out to Sat World. They crushed it, 2231. We had Titan over a thousand accounts. Sid Core over uh, 400. PHS landslide, uh, 227, 199. You can kind of see uh, the the crescendo down there, but uh, exciting to see those numbers. 6,620 accounts is an amazing month. Jumping over to some other really cool Domo stats. It was uh, this previous week based on install date, so got some data here. Uh, Sat World is crushing it in volume as well as Titan. Great job on low risk percentage uh, to Sat World, 79%. Shout out to Landslide 84, PHS 92, Edge 81, uh, CDS 86. Jumping down here, Elite 1 83, Auto Pay. Um, bigger numbers are better here 66%, PHS 63% for uh, CDS and Think HD. Elite 1 with 83%. Awesome. Prepaid. So smaller numbers are better here. Just got to give a shout out to Complete Digital. 0% uh, prepaids, love it. Unit numbers, again, smaller numbers are better here, so shout out to Edge and uh, Skytech for uh, for doing good on that. So anyway, great job, awesome week, awesome month, keep it up. Jumping into some housekeeping items. So guys, we got this Partner Summit coming up in Vegas for anyone that's done over 150 installs year to date. They're invited. I want to see one executive from each company minimum there. I know a lot of people have reached out to me to see if they can bring additional key players in their businesses or key managers. Uh, I highly encourage it. Again, we just ask you to cover their uh, their lodging, but got a cool registration form. Again, that's in South Point Casino, November 16th and 17th. That's a Thursday and Friday. We'll start Thursday at 2 o'clock and be done Friday at 5, so... Uh, Anyway, should be a lot of fun. We're going to go to the Wicked Spoon Buffet. It's the uh, number one rated buffet for desserts in uh, in Vegas. So I've got a little, uh, Sarah sent out a link, but it's this Clear Home Summit registration. If you, you get it, you scroll down and it's a Google form. You put in your email address, uh, what company you're with, manager, regional owner, uh, depending on who's there, number of attendees. There's a cool drop down here. So, you know, obviously we're covering one person. Anyway, there's a couple other pages on there, but we need that filled out. Uh, not everyone's registered yet. Please, if you have not done so, register today. We uh, we need to get a final count on figuring all that stuff out. Um, sales rep strike policy. You guys all know. You know we got to eliminate fraud. You can't change phone numbers, names, addresses. Uh, you can't run people like a bajillion times. Just uh, work with John Clifton and Pace, our uh, our company attorney, on on that on staying. Uh, you know. Training your guys the right way on how to properly use Sales Rabbit. Guys, you'll have a new onboarding page. It'll be clearhomepartners.com backslash the name of your company. So you'll have your own um, page to onboard uh, uh, new reps you know, into, into the, the company. So that'll be cool. Uh, again, just a reminder on the cooling off period. Uh, we want to have a six-month cooling off period, meaning if they haven't worked for you know, our door to door thing or some of the other uh, P10 companies we have an agreement with, like that just has to happen. I know sometimes you can be on the short end of that stick and it, you know, kind of sucks, but other times it's really nice to have that, uh, you know, six month portion of protection on the people you develop and cultivate. So just a reminder on that. Um, moving on, actually, I'm going to make this thing into a little presentation here. Um, just a reminder, uh, we're doing quality control um, install checks and we will be sending out I'll have Sarah send out a uh, an updated list of what we're looking for what Jason Thompson's looking for in a uh, in a install that's up to quality uh, again just a reminder Sarah is going to be your guys's main point of contact she's part of the connect team and she is awesome she's been uh, sending stuff out on group me Facebook she'll do email list and she'll be sending out the spotlight um, just a reminder, we'll talk about this a little bit more in Vegas, but as, uh, as Clear Home really uh, dials in this channel, we've got to pay the people that are creating the most value the most amount. So just just know we're trying to standardize the comp plan. Um, 
to really rewarding the right quality uh, as well as the volume. Got to get our training um, in check a little bit better. Uh, Bob Voisney, he took over Stefan Goldstein's spot with AT&T. And Kristen Haley is with the legal team there. So we've got Pace Johnson, our attorney, and John Clifton really helping us catch things before they become a big issue and elevate to the level of uh, Bob Voisney or Kristen Haley. Definitely want to avoid that. and uh, It's great having Clifton and Pace helping us... Uh, you know, do training a little bit better. Um, just some gating policies in the uh, the call center. With DOMA, we really can measure, uh, you know, things by the individual. And that's a super cool thing. So any individual that's doing over 25% medium risk or prepaids, um, you know, is going to be asked not to be doing any more medium risk or prepaids until they get down below that threshold. And that's there to protect, you know, us as a company, but you also as a business owner. Uh, processing fees, we're going to do in increments of 25, 35, and 50. I'm jumping to the next slide here for a second. Um, sorry, I got these a little out of order. But all processing fees uh, moving forward as of November 1st need to be made out to clear home. So if you're doing it on a credit card, it just has to go through our Gemini merchant account um, thing there. If it is a check, it needs to be made out to clear home. All right. In the past, I think it's been made out to various different companies. But moving forward, it's got to be made out to clear home. Uh, the way our payroll department does it is it's not a separate work order for that processing fee. It's built into the original invoice. And so uh, those checks need to be sent in once a week to the Orem office. Once they get that, um, that's when it's like built into the original invoice and you get compensated on it. So just be aware of that. Uh, we no longer are allowing people to collect cash. Um, Jumping back here, uh, again, just uh, in, in getting things in line with AT&T, everything has to start and end with Clear Home. You know, all the jobs need to be done by our call center, recorded, verified, and then they need to be, you know, finished with a Clear Home technician completing the install. Um, I'm stoked for Vegas. I want to get you guys more training and on Domo and visibility into this data. It's just so cool, the stuff that it can do. Um, again, uh, let's see, Rich Gudati's letter. So Rich is a VP with uh, AT&T, and he's really cracking down on the physical agreements. So each week, if you don't have these AT&T agreements, uh, let Sarah know. She can get them sent out to you. But... A lot of you use sales rabbit and that's awesome. You know, all the guys on the door to door side do as well. They do the whole order just as normal on a uh, sales rabbit and they just tell the customers um, that they need to leave them a receipt, you know, or a work order. They fill it out again, have them sign it. Um, but you need to bring that original signature copy back to some main office and send it into our Arizona office, which Sarah will get that uh, address out to everyone. But, I need those coming in once a week. Uh, a lot of you have seen that letter and read through it, but they, uh, they're they definitely not messing around. They need to have a physical agreement on every customer as well as that recorded uh, call. I already talked about processing fees. Um, just a little reminder, the old now communication partners, uh, you'll have to utilize two different agendas for the next six months dealing with chargebacks. No, it's a pain in the butt, but uh, time will take care of that. Um, I've been, I spent a day up working with sales rabbit in Utah. Um, they are working on designing some more base stats so we can create our new 10.0 quality score system that should be done by January. Um, in this, uh, you know, a little bit of a chaos with transitioning, you know, there is no more clear satellite. There is no more now communications. It's one new entity called clear home. And with that brings a lot of changes. I appreciate all of your guys' patience on this, but uh, you know, it's there's still going to be a lot of changes for the next year moving forward before it all kind of gets settled in. But uh, a thought I really like on that is by uh, John Ruskin, but it says the highest reward for a person's toil is not what they get for it, but what they become by it. I felt like that was uh, an applicable thing um, for you guys to kind of take and present to your company and your reps and, uh, you know, people in your own organization is, you know, when things are difficult, it's not, it's not always about the money. It's about the, the personal growth, the leadership growth and 
what you become through the experience. Anyway, love you guys. Keep up the great work. Talk to you later. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. We love you. Go have a good week. Make some money.